The scientists from the U.S. National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration detected a series of eruptions on the Sun on May 19, 2022, which occurred in the sunspot AR-3014. There is a real storm in this region, which means that not only the frequency of flares on the Sun will increase, but also their simultaneous number may grow shortly. Near-Earth satellites have already detected a stream of solar flares coming toward the planet. This can cause geomagnetic storms and disruptions in radio communications and navigation devices. Solar activity and space weather are monitored by both NASA instruments near the Sun and the Earth's satellites. According to scientists, there were 3M-class flares on May 19, although before that there was supposed to be a probability of X-class flares. All three flares occurred in the sunspot AR-3014, which was directed to the Earth. According to scientists, this region of the Sun is buzzing with extremely powerful emissions of energy into space. Flares and coronal mass ejections appear when magnetic field lines in sunspots reconnect and break. These are enormous energy bursts and fluxes of solar plasma, which have already reached Earth by now. Although there were no X-class flares on the Sun for once, which are the most powerful flares possible and can cause the strongest geomagnetic storm on Earth, their counterparts, as many as 3M-class flares, do not predict anything good either. M-class flares, of course, are 10 times less powerful than X-class flares, nevertheless, the probability of geomagnetic storms and disturbances in radio communications and navigation devices is still possible. The GO-16 near-Earth satellite has already detected the solar particles coming to Earth. According to scientists, the consequences of a series of these solar flares will be felt for several days. Perhaps we can say that the Sun woke up in early 2022, as the number of flares increased sharply. There were especially many in April and in the first half of May. Among these solar eruptions, scientists have also recorded the most powerful X-class flares. Our star is approaching its maximum activity during the 11-year cycle, which will peak in 2025. Scientists continue to study the Sun's activity in an attempt to predict the possible negative consequences for the Earth due to flares and coronal mass ejections.